Hey everyone, and welcome to this video. Today, I'm going to be showing you this 2013 Hyundai Veloster. The dealership I am at is Cardinal Kia. Their inventory is right here, but there is more on their website. So, let's get this car started up, and we'll show you around the outside. Now, this car does come equipped with remote keyless start, so let's put your key fob right there, or you can leave it in your pocket. I'm putting it right there because I'm leaving the car. Put the clutch in, press the start stop button make sure it's in neutral because it is a six-speed manual and your power windows are located right here we'll put the window down which is auto down and show you around the outside starting with the front driver corner coming up to the front you'll see it has almost new tires on it which are 215 40R18 tires on aluminum wheels with black accents as well you have a lock nut disc brakes on the front as well as the rear it is a silver color car and coming up to the passenger door I mean the driver door You'll notice it has smart key access right here. Which makes it so you don't even need the key to open the door or the remote key fob. Coming around the back. It is a really neat looking vehicle actually. It's got a, it's a hatchback so and your reverse camera is located right here. Open at the back, it opens up very large. You have a package tray right here, which is released right by these hooks up here. And under here, you have your spare tire with all your equipment to change your tire. Baby seat attachments there with a hook there and you have a factory sub right there to put the seats down those knobs right there done like that and like that which greatly improves your cargo space in the back of this vehicle you have an assist handle right here to pull down on we'll close up the back and you do have a rear wiper on this vehicle. This vehicle comes with tinted windows as well. And you have your third door on the passenger side. With a shark fin antenna on the roof. And your smart key access is as well usable on the passenger door. Coming up to the front. You'll see your headlights which are halogen headlights as well as you have fog lights down below with a chrome bar with your Hyundai symbol, symbol in the middle. Under the hood, you have a 1.6 liter inline four cylinder, which puts out 138 horsepower at 6,300 RPMs and, 48, and 123 foot-pounds of torque at 4,850 RPMs. For fuel economy, you will expect to see 8 liters per 100 kilometers in the city, 5 liters per 100 kilometers on the highway, with a combined of 6.7 liters per 100 kilometers, running on regular unleaded fuel with a fuel tank of 50 liters. Your hood is held up with gas shocks, so there is no prop rob with this vehicle. Very clean engine bay, very good running car. We'll close up the hood now, and we'll move on to the interior of the car.
into the interior, you'll see that the door is a black interior door panel. Patterned plastic up here. A little bit of harder plastic down here, but vinyl padded inserts here and here with your power windows, power locks, power mirrors, and your door handle pull right there. With a cup holder here and storage there, which is all mirrored on the passenger door. Look on in, you'll see a black leather with patterned cloth interior, a manual driver's seat, as well as passenger seat. We'll step on in now, and you'll see this vehicle has 22,631 kilometers on it, as well as tinted windows. You have your air vent right here, closed, open. Right here you have your cluster lighting, parking sensors, traction control, and you have a power plug somewhere in the car. Your gauges, you have a speedometer, tachometer, then your info infotainment center here which shows your coolant temperature and your gas gauge. On your steering column you have headlights, turn signals, and on this side your wipers along with your rear wiper. Small steering wheel, leather wrapped with your radio controls, phone controls, and your cruise control as well as infotainment center buttons. You have a speaker up there, speaker there on either door, and when you open up your visors you have a mirror, which is also lit. Glasses holder right there. Dome lights. Your sunroof here, which is a full panoramic sunroof. I will not be opening it right now because it is a little cold outside and I don't want it to leak after. Manual dimming mirror. Coming down in the center stack, you'll see your navigation touch screen. FM, a AM, FM, XM radio with auxiliary and USB. Heated seats. Auto cl your climate control is down here. Your zones are right here. And you have your tune and volume button right here. Fan speed and your temperature there. In your glove box, push that button and it opens right up. It's a decently sized glove box with your all your literature for the car. Two power plugs right here. And we'll put the clutch in. One, two, three, four, five, six. And your reverse is pull this up, push over, and up. And you do have a reverse camera which comes through the navigation screen. Pull that out, put it in neutral again. You have two cup holders right here, e brake, padded armrest, which is two tier storage. And here is your 120 volt outlet. Veloster batch carpets. And let's move on to the back seat. And we'll see how well I sit behind myself. Coming to the back of these cars, you'll see it's a kind of a strange setup. It has one door on the driver's side, but two doors on the passenger side. Materials carry all the way throughout into the back seat are the same. And let's see how well I can sit behind myself. It does make it easier to get in, though. I do like having that third door. And right here, you have a storage pocket, two cup holders, and when we get behind myself, well, it's roomy enough. I fit, my head's not hitting anything, and it's actually a pretty comfortable seat. Let's get out of the car now. Take one more quick pan around. And then, 
on the video there. Aluminum wheels, 18 inch, black and silver, six speed manual, reverse camera, 2013, 1.6 liter, fog lights, smart key access, keyless start, sunroof which is panoramic. Anyways guys, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, favorite, and share this video. Have a great day everyone.